on through everything. If she hears you, it'll be the last. <sighs> Praise the Absolute, sister. She will reward us well for this exquisite carnage. The true honor is to serve the Absolute. She loves you fiercely. I see that in the strength she has given you. And she has so much more to give. There is a bond between us, true soul. I can see what you are. What you want. And you can see what I want. Through her eyes you see yourself. Skin glistening with sweat, hands bound. Ecstasy, or terror, maybe both. You feel her breath on your neck, her fingers running down your spine, and then it is over. I will come to your camp tonight. We will celebrate this victory together. As you approach your camp, the raucous celebrations have already begun. Volo has fallen into the goblins' clutches again and appears to be chronicling your misdeeds. The goblins praise the Absolute, but their celebrations also honor their leaders, Minthara and you. You fought well, and so did these creatures, thanks to our leadership. When you tire of their company, Come to me. Tonight, you are mine. This one is a true soul parasite. It can enhance you. You can absorb its potential. Open your mind to it. You already know how. Don't worry, you won't come to harm. I'll protect you. You are not ready. That's all right. But try to overcome this resistance sooner rather than later. It will make things much easier for you. ever to the dark. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? Let the Absolute hear your prayers. Let the blood of her enemies flow over you. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. The presence deep in your mind is awake, unblinking. This is it. A single word pervades your consciousness. Soon. Glory to the absolute! Ah. 
our gift to the Absolute. May the whole world see his strength. I got it all red here. Red for our love of the Absolute. <laughs> The guest of honor arrives. I've been observing the festivities from a um, sensible distance. Fear not. I am content and quite forgotten where I am. Better in a cell than in a stew, what? <laughs> but I'd rather talk about you. If I'm to write an account of the battle, I'll need details while they're still sticky. What you did at the Grove. I rather think the world should remember. Don't you? I have no doubt. But such grand deeds as yours often require interpretation. The Grove, for example. The unenlightened might see your actions there as no more than aimless slaughter. I know you had a purpose, though I'll grant that I'm quite in the dark as to what it was. Might you elaborate? Of course not. I am only here to bear witness. It is for Callum for to judge you when the time comes. May he do so justly. Let's get on with it. Let's get going. Don't lift a finger, boss. I'm keeping guard. You go have a drink. You smoked them all out like it was nothing, true soul. Imagine what a disciple could do. Never seen a true soul in action before. I'd follow you to the hells and back. Once we rested, we should carve our way right to Boulder's Gate. Whole world needs to know what we did here. Never thought I'd be fully when I drowned my own free will. I didn't come out of the battle alive. <laughs> the absolute smiles on you. On all of us. I have seen the Kithraki tear a screaming Neogi's legs from its belly to fashion into blades. 
Yet, they could not match your nerve today. It was enough to drive me to madness. I smell their blood on you still. I smell your moisture. How torturous for us both that I'll never get a taste. Oh, but do enjoy yourself this night. I intend to myself. What a glorious celebration. Hip deep in gore. The goblins stole good wine. It goes straight to the head. What's wrong with enjoying a gift from our guests? Maybe, if I down enough of this swill, it'll pickle the worm in my skull. We set a pack of refugees on fire. A child could have done it. Not exactly an ambush for the ages. Maybe, but I know better than to share my bed drunk. Unless you meant to raise my spirits by other means. I prefer to keep a few things secret. It's old habit. Thank you. The offer's kind, but it's not a kindness I can afford. Looking ahead. Here's my little treat with their cheeks all flushed. You will come to my bed tonight, won't you? Ah, you need a bit of enticing let me see hmm how about this one every time i heard the tieflings cry i remembered how you sounded crying for me hmm let me give it another go every part of your perfect body whispers temptation. It's as if the gods made you just to ruin me. <laughs> I can go all night with the flattery. But is that really all you want? How about if I said these little words? Everyone's favorite. I love you. <laughs> I am. It's hard not to with you. Now, as much as I relish standing around and saying all my favorite lines at you, I'd much rather we got to experience each other's uh, full portfolio of talents once again.
I look forward to the day. Meanwhile, my hunger for you will only deepen.